Hi, I'm Michael Cornell with the Align Ballet Method, and I'm here with a special guest today, Mari New. She's an amazing ballerina who uh, studied for a long time in Russia and now lives in Los Angeles. And we're happy to have her as a guest dancer today. Uh, she's going to start doing some teaching with us here in our Los Angeles studio. Um, and we're covering, covering today an advanced adagio. So we're going to get right into it. Hopefully you watched the first video, which was about how to extend your leg into the air, how to uh, increase your développé heights. And we're going to show this advanced adagio. This is the adagio I've been working on in my intermediate class the past few weeks in Los Angeles. So we're going to start in fifth position. And she will go through the passe position. And we're going to développé écarté derrière. So she pivots away from the bar, lifting the knee in the air. Right, and we're going to close behind. Beautiful. And she's going to brush into a deep plié. Always go low in this and then go high into the susu. Right, exactly. And to écarté devant. Exactly. You want to experience different level heights. And from the height of this demi point, she's going to brush into a deep plié, extending the leg up and then back to the susu. She's going to brush side to Alice Comte. Single rond de jambe on de R, and then a beautiful double rond de jambe, and she closes front. Amazing. And repeating that. Single on de or, and double, boom, boom, and close back. Then we'll repeat the whole combination reversing. Passe, développe, écarté, devant. Plié, croisé, arabesque. Passe, écarté, derrière, and brushing front. Plié and into susu, and then en dedans, brush, single en dedans, double, close, and brush, single, and double, and close. Inside leg brushes to arabesque, penche all the way over, lifting the chest to recover, and plié relevé attitude, pivoting to the other side of the bar through the passe, plié allongé devant, Susu, and we're going to port de bras forward on de, sorry, port de bras forward on demi point. Beautiful. Showing that cambre all the way back. Amazing. And then she'll go passe, attitude, and let go. Exactly. Incredible. This is beautiful demonstration. That's why I was excited to work with this fine dancer. Yeah, that was incredible. Do you have any tips for this exercise? Anything you'd like to uh, suggest? Well, from a technical point, of course, we want to always be thinking about our turnout, keeping the inner thighs forward, et cetera, working all those things, shoulders down, all our usual corrections. From an artistic point, make sure that you're really following the fingertips with your hand, really using your chest to sort of reach things to the last moment, because the difference between an arabesque that's sort of here versus an arabesque that is extended from the chest as well as we get the emotion with that as well instead of it just being a sort of static position so take your chest with it it's a lifetime of work <laughs> yeah if you like this video don't forget to click subscribe if you'd like to train with us virtually you could get a free month of virtual training with us all levels at our website alignballetmethod.com go sign up for that let's watch this beautiful video play along with home and home even if you just grab a chair to hold on to or you hold on to a wall and mark through and what i would recommend is mari has such a beautiful movement quality so if you can start to emulate or imitate her style of movement, her musicality. It's really great as you're developing as a dancer to watch very advanced dancers and replicate the way they move, their quality of movement. Let's try, you ready? Here we go, and I'll help talk her through because this is only the first time she's done this combination. So here we go, music, it's a long introduction. Here we go. Développé et and we brush front, assemble, inside, good, air back, suit, rond de jambe, double, closing front, floating the leg down, side, good. And we reverse the whole combination towards the bar, tip, brush the inside leg back, and 
Diablo. Inside leg, front. And single. Good. Closing behind. And brush. And air. Arch. Beautiful. That was amazing. Did everybody see the way she finished the exercise? Could you show that again? I wish all my students would do this. See this classical finish? Watch this. Arm comes down, head is turned, and chin is lifted right there. That, I wish more students would do this. It's so nice. It's actually pretty respectful for your teacher, you know? And it's training also. It's conditioning you when you finish your variation. You're always going to finish. You have a, a period at the end of your sentence. That was beautiful. Thank you so much. Let's just, uh, while I was watching her work, let's talk about one really powerful idea. Uh, counterbalance when you're lowering a leg. You know, a lot of teachers will talk to you about getting your leg into the air, and you'll all, all want to get your leg into the air. But an added piece of information, one way to strengthen the hip flexor is to resist the leg back down. And often people can't get their leg high in the air because their hip flexors are very weak. They literally don't have the strength to lift the leg. But one way to develop that strength is every time you do a develop, you resist the leg back down to the floor slowly. That builds the strength in the hip flexor. It will give you more physical endurance for your adagio. I've noticed that sometimes she had no problem with this. Like she could do that all day long because she has a physical endurance for this type of work, which is actually not easy. So, and then the other thing I will recommend is as the leg comes down, so if you could just hold the développé to the side, as the leg comes down, you feel an energy shift where you lift up on the other side of the body. That creates a counterweight a counterweight. As the leg comes down, you should be growing taller and driving into the supporting leg. As the leg goes down, you go up. If you could just show that one more time. So she goes, passe, développe. So she wants to think of growing taller. It will also help stabilize you on your support. So yeah, and especially grombot malls, you see people going grombot mall and they drop the leg. If you could just show a grombot mall to the front with the resistance back to the floor. Up, and that's how it's done, everybody. One more time, up, it's so beautiful. Thank you, Mari. My pleasure. Amazing, really great demonstration. We're gonna have more videos, so watch the next one and enjoy this exquisite dancing. Thank you.